Hello you lovely lovely people, this is Hardcore Blello and I am Michael Boardman. So it's another story time so get yourself a nice big drink, sit back, listen, enjoy. Uh, so a couple of months ago I was working in a warehouse and if you work in a warehouse you know the you just turn into a zombie for the day and just get your work done as quickly as possible. Good advice, if you can work in a warehouse, learn to be a zombie for the day. And I was only a couple of weeks in to start in the job and I hadn't been keeping up to targets and I'd been making a few errors and so when the boss, not boss people, but when the retrainee people came around and collected a couple of us who weren't making, meeting targets and causing a few errors and, well, having a few mistakes and stuff like that. He gathered us all together and put us to one of the stations. And The job was pretty simple. You just get the boxes that are coming into the warehouse, unpack them and put them into plastic tubs and then send them on. That's the job. But collected up by this retrainee guy, or whatever they're called, don't know. Basically, they gathered the dust together and explained, all right, we're gonna make sure you're doing your job right because we see you're not meeting your targets and there's been a few errors and stuff. So it's just a warning. It's just to make sure we know that you're doing everything right if you're doing everything right, then it's probably a problem further down the line, maybe. Fair enough. Saving our asses a bit. So the first guy went up and he had a big, he pulled a big box just full of earphones out and he went through it, did his box and then sent off the box and then it was the next guy's turn and he carried on with the earphones and then another guy had his go, continue with the phones. So basically it got down to me and there was only a few earphones left so I finished those up, put them into the box and turned around grabbed another box and just slammed it in front of me and see so now part of the job is you you get like a little scanner so you scan the item and then you check, make sure what's on the computer is the same as what the item is. So I finished off these earphones, pulled out the next box, slammed it in front of me, scanned the item, looked up on the screen. Now, I must say, all the guys who'd already gone before are still stood around with the instructor as well. So they're all crowding in over my shoulders and I've scanned it and I look up and I read what's on screen. And I look it down into my hand and I can't believe it. On screen it says Rainbow Willies. I had to look down. I look at it in my hand. And I look at this thing in my hand. And I swear to God, it's six inches of knitwear for a penis. With little testicles to go with it. It was a six inch knitted cock. It was a six inch knitted cock. Someone, someone in their great wisdom decided that somewhere out there someone needed a six inch knitted cock for whatever reason. <laughs> it sounds completely made up but it is true. And I just broke down and giggled and I didn't meet my targets for that particular box. Thank you for watching. Hopefully I've earned a like and a subscribe from you. Tune in next week.